we go to the cave, park the bike. Hello there, hello. Hi. And uh, they ask you for uh, uh, for COVID, uh, and uh, you can go in and uh, get a ticket. What is going on? So it looks like we're going from here. No English, nowhere. Okay, so we got into the boat. What do you think? Storici grazie anche a qualche oggi, Paolo Ferrucci e Giovanni Padroni, durante i primi scambi di animali, oggetti che erano animali, dietro scelte di animali, delle colapiti e anche diverse intenze. Alcuni di loro fecero capire che cosa si dedicava a loro in questa parte. Io sono che addirittura posso lavorare a un certo modo. L'ingresso invece le prime notizie che abbiamo grazie a un altro americano di Bologna, Leandro sulla cartina meridionale dell'Italia anche l'ingresso della grotta. Nelle sue scritture parlava di un piccolo altare che stava un armonino di assistenza. Quelli 10 gradi, molto fredda, non c'è vita in acqua pesce. Sì, è molto interessante. Mi ricordo che c'è uno in Peloponnese, che va in video, mi ricordo che c'è uno in Peloponnese, che puoi vedere uno in South Greece. Βγάζει πίσω όλη τη σάλα όμως. Okay, so the tourist penis, you need a fleece in there, it's cold. And uh, outside it's like 35. And you gotta get, uh, you gotta be here in advance, uh, call for a you know, for an uh, appointment or something, because it's really busy. Okay. 
Even the pathway is nice. Yeah. So, what do you think? It was very, very nice. Yes. Impressive? Yes. <laughs> All right, see you guys later. How is the machine? So this is the park we're gonna hang out to find a pizzeria. I'm gonna eat pizza today, but look how beautiful this is. You see the cave in there? Okay. That's the, uh, I think that's the entrance or the other side or something like that. It's recording? Yes. Okay. He wants the picture with the waterfall. I have a kid with me. That's okay. Here I relax, watching our videos, drinking, drinking frappe. Fra frappe, iced coffee being great, and uh, beautiful, beautiful uh, sunset. Uh, Mario is going to feed the pigs. He asked him to go look at them, and then I told him I want to relax. Do you want to go look at the pigs? No. No. <laughs> so, look at that. Check it out. Beautiful sunset. And we took a table outside. like a part of me that this is the most smooth red wine I have ever drank in my life Mario the owner makes it and he invited me also to feed the pigs with him but I, <laughs> you know I nicely refused <laughs> beautiful right. okay everybody see you later <laughs>